Before Luke Littler dramatically changed the PDC world, there was another young player up there who by all accounts would soon arrive in the elite of the darts world. This player is Josh Rock. He arrived in PDC in 2022 and immediately showed his talent. In his first year, he won a player championship, the World Youth Championship, and continued to perform well in the following years. He is still missing a major victory, but if he keeps it up, he will surely get there. In this video, we will analyze position, stance, grip, front camera, throwing action and speed. Let's discover the secrets of rock throw. Josh positioned himself exactly at the center of the throwing line. He uses a forward stance, a middle way between close and open stance, with the supporting foot at 45 degrees. Compared to his beginnings in PDC, he has slightly changed his position. Before he was a little more to the right, now exactly in the middle. If we draw a line from the eye to the heel, we can see that everything is perfectly aligned. Rock stance is excellent. Beyond the forearm, practically nothing moves. The elbow is very solid, quite high, in perfect line with the shoulders. In general, it is a nice stance to see. Little note, when he releases the third dart, there is a movement of the non-supporting foot, somewhat reminiscent of Rob Cross. However, it does not impact the throw. Arm fully extended in the release, but we will see in detail later. Talking about grip, Josh uses a classic three-finger pencil grip. Thumb and index finger hold the barrel at the front, very close to the tip. The middle finger gives balance resting under the tip and by supporting it. Very common grip used by others such as Dave Chisnall. From the front cam, we can see that Josh is right eye dominant. The alignment is really perfect with his elbow at practically 90 degrees and a straight release. Note how much Rock moves his head during the throw, not something you usually see. However, he manages to return to the correct position. Definitely something not to be recommended, but he does it perfectly. Let's analyze Rock throwing action. His action is really fluent and clean. Josh sets the dart to about 100 degrees, then performs pullback to about 77 degrees, and finally release the dart with the arm fully extended. See how during the pullback, Rock flicks his wrist, which then leads him to an handprint with the wrist fully bent after the release. Speed is not an element that affects the level of a darts player. However, I usually like to include it in the analysis because it is an element that adds awesomeness in a match. Josh takes about four and a half seconds to release the darts. We can safely call Josh Rock a fast player. Thank you for watching the video. Write in the comments who you would like to be analyzed next.